Does anybody remember that video that I made about two months ago about Squirmy and Grubs, about how their relationship is fake and phony? Well, I lost a lot of subscribers from that video, but that doesn't matter because the truth shall always reign supreme. I stand by everything I said in that video. They are a fake, phony channel. There is nothing real about the relationship, okay? It's ultimately fake. It's ultimately phony. A uh, disabled guy is not going to score three hot girls in a row. It's just not going to happen. Anyways, I had a lot of people in the comments section saying that I was this, I was that. I was an ableist, I'm a sexist, blah, 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 yada, yada, yada. Okay, that's fine. So there's a YouTuber out there that made a 38-minute video, a reaction video about my video about Squirmy and Grubs. And I said, oh boy, what do we have here? Now, I normally don't watch, first of all, I don't even really see any videos about people that make videos about me because I don't really care. Uh, but this one happened to come up in my search feed and I don't know why. So I started watching it and this is again, a 38 minute video. This girl pretty much did a reaction video to me. Uh, she would play some of my video and explain that I'm an ableist, I'm a sexist, uh, I'm this, I'm that. She just totally ripped me a new a-hole, right? Now, let me say this. First of all, the girl has cerebral palsy, okay? She is uh, disabled. Uh, she has a problem speaking. You can understand, you know, when she speaks, but she has a little bit of a speech impediment, slightly, but she can still convey her point and get it across. So I'm at the gym. And I said, okay, I'm gonna ride the elliptical for 40 minutes and I'm just gonna listen and watch this video. And I did, it's the only video that anybody has ever made about me that I actually watched uh, in the entirety. Well, at least a couple other videos I've watched, but mainly I don't watch them, but this one, I had to. So again, this girl is saying I'm, I'm a bad person, I'm this, I'm that, blah, 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 right? And I'm just watching it and, I, and I'm looking at her and she's saying in the video, that, uh, you know, disabled people are just like normal people and that, yes, for her own case, she might need help bathing and getting dressed. Uh, but uh, they're just like, you know, disabled people are just like everybody else, um, which isn't true because disabled people sometimes can't do what able-bodied people can do. And that's just the fact of life that you're going to have to accept. Uh, moving forward. So I'm looking at this broad. And, she, you know, she's not bad looking. You know, I would date her. I would take her out. Uh, she's not ugly by any means. She's she's okay. I Probably average looking, I would say. Uh, maybe she's a five, could be a six uh, if, you, if she spruced herself up a little bit. And on another channel, she has videos talking about other people, um, talking about how, about her life with cerebral palsy and what have you. And, you know, I'm, I, I'm gonna come out and just say it right now. I think this girl is totally wrong about me. I think a lot of women that don't know me off of, uh, that don't know me off of YouTube, I think they're generally wrong about me. Uh, I do have two sides to myself, okay? I have a very, very serious side that I don't mess around and I conduct business and what have you. But I also have another side, which is the side that you see here, where I, you know, I have this channel, this platform, where I can, you know, vent, if you will, tell people how I, uh, how, how frustrated I might be uh, throughout the day. <coughs> so this girl is just, you know, womp, 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 you know, blah, blah, blah. And I said, you know what? If this girl were to meet me and let me take her out, for a night we go hang out and not in a sex way just dinner uh we'll go wherever it's on me I, whatever restaurant her favorite restaurant wherever she lives i would take her out and i would only need three or four hours and i promise you at the end of the night she would she would absolutely adore me and i do mean that uh when it comes to women i come across very rough around the edges and I am and you know what amazes me about certain people is when I make videos 
And sometimes I'm trolling, sometimes I'm not. It's up to you to decide uh, if I'm being serious or I'm being not. People will swear that I'm I'm this uh, disgusting creep and that I'm horrible I and mean, I'm a bad person. I'm a bad person because I said that I wouldn't date a woman who buys her body wash from the Dollar Tree. Okay, so what if I wouldn't? Who cares? They sell $2 body wash at Target. If you want to go to Dollar Tree and load up, that's fine. I'm not interested in that. Why would you care if a homeless guy says that he wouldn't date a woman who buys her body wash at the Dollar Tree? Not going over that again, but I'm saying that's a that's a good uh, example of what I'm talking about. I don't come on YouTube saying that, oh, if a woman doesn't have at least C-cup boobs and a fat ass that I wouldn't date her. For God's sake, I would date a, from a one to 10, I would date a four. I would totally date a four. You have to have a really good personality, I'm not gonna lie. But if you had an average personality, you have to be at least a five. For me to be in a relationship with you, there has to you know, be some kind of sexual attraction. And I would assume that on your uh, side of things, you would have to be attracted to me. Now, I'm not everybody's cup of tea. Uh, some people think I'm fucking ugly. You know, hey, it is what it is. I don't care. I believe most women would not find me attractive, but I do believe that a certain few out there that are crazy, oh, they think I'm hot shit. They think I'm a fucking model. You know what I mean? Beauty is in the eye of the beholder. Uh, women, you know, may, they may not like a guy with a bald head or big ears or dresses like a bum or sleeps in his car uh, or has a small pee pee or, or, or whatever. Uh, big ears. I think I covered that already. You know what I mean? But some women do. Some women do like that. So anyways, getting back to the girl with the cerebral palsy. Uh, you know, listen, how about we do this? Erica, that's your name, Erica. I don't know where you live. Uh, right now, I am in Connecticut. Shut up, I'm talking. Don't you see I'm talking to the girl? Hey, you stupid. This is why I hate doing videos in my van sometimes. Hey, listen, I want to ask her out. And I, I mean that from the bottom of my heart. This is not a troll at all. This is not a troll. I would like to take you out. Let me talk to you. I, I, I'd like to take you out. I know that what you've seen in the video... Uh, you did not care for, but that is only one part of the whole grand pooba that is uh, Black Bigelow, uh, Male Gigolo. Uh, I would like to take you out. Uh, no sex involved, of course. I'm not going to try to get in your pants. Well, unless you want me to get in your pants. But anyways, uh, listen, I'm being serious. I'd like to take you out um, wherever you want to go, me and you. Uh, let me know. Uh, what do you think? Uh, 972-765-8972. 972-765-8972. And again, I don't know where you where you live at, but uh, I mean, I go all over the country, so I'll probably be in your neck of the woods sometime, uh, you know, pretty soon anyways. I don't know. What do you guys think? You think she'll, uh, you think she'll take me up on the offer? Uh, you could email me if you want. TacoBellCriminal at gmail.com. You know, and listen, if even if you don't want to meet me because I, I made a comment on your channel Let's go out. And you said that you don't date uh, ableist. Um, listen, uh, I'm not an ableist. I'm a realist. And I'm not going to play pretend. Okay. I'm not going to play pretend that you're able to do a double, double dutch jump roping. Okay. That's not going to happen, right? I call it the way I see it. Uh, we live in a society now where shit is dumbed down. Uh, people have their blinders on and nobody wants to say that god honest truth and you know people like me purveyors of the truth uh will do their due diligence every day to let that truth out and let everybody know that you're not alone okay you're not alone when you think that men should not be in the bathroom with women okay that's not normal i it does not matter what you say or what you think it's not normal okay and I'm going to say that. And most people agree. It's not normal. Okay. The leftist media might have it to where they, they, they think that it's normal and that you're thinking that they're thinking is normal. It's not. I promise you it's not. 
Anyways, give me a call, 972-765-8972. I'd like to take you out. Peace out.